An Australian aircraft Thursday detected a fifth signal that could be coming from one of the black boxes aboard missing Malaysian Air Flight 370, adding to hopes that searchers will soon pinpoint or at least narrow the object's location. Once they do, they're putting high hopes on the Bluefin 21 submarine, an unmanned robotic vehicle built at this shipyard facility in Quincy, Massachusetts. It's currently aboard Australia's Ocean Shield vessel, ready to be deployed. The Bluefin can travel to the deepest parts of the ocean, two and a half miles below the surface and image the ocean floor. One of the great things about it is that it can work at the extreme operational environment, the great depths that we're expected to have to survey, and that allows us to put the vehicle down, map the area, and return objects of interest. Once deployed underwater, the Bluefin sub will use sonar technology to comb the ocean floor. So it looks to each side of the vehicle, approximately 500 meters aside, and then in that, it is able to return what we call objects of interest. Objects that O'Halloran says would be out of place on a normal ocean floor. They'll tend to have man-made features and right angles, among other characteristics. But O'Halloran warns the Bluefin's mission will take time and patience. The ocean is massive, it's vast, and it's unexplored. But first, it's going to require a more precise location. Kelly Daschle, Associated Press.